answer okay I will insert the 1000 rupiahs coin and the balance is 1000 I will edit again and the balance is 2000 now and 3000 and then 4000 and then 5000 and then 6000 how about uh, if we insert the wrong coin and okay so this is the coin acceptor the type is gd gd 100f gd 100f and this coin can read and this coin acceptor can read one coin one coin only so you just can read one type of coin using this sensor and this is the pin out you can read the pin out here there is the counter DC 12 volt coin signal the ground and then counter and this is the NO and NC normally open or normally close and this is the speed there is slow, medium and fast the slow will take about 100 milliseconds medium 50 milliseconds and the fast is 25 milliseconds so uh, we will use the fast mode and we'll use the new normally open and you can input your coin from here let's test this sensor using Arduino okay so this is the wiring diagram you can see the wiring diagram and we will try to use this Okay, this is the complete wiring. I use the 10k resistor here to pull up the signal from the sensor. So we just need an additional pull up for the sensor. And now we try to insert the coin. So now I have three type of coin. So this is 500 rupiah. And this is 500 but different and this is 1000 rupiah I will try from here first so we can insert the coin to the sensor just insert the coin to here like this right before we continue the video please subscribe and ring the bell to make us more enthusiastic
and energize to make another video. Okay. And now I'm powering up the sensor. Oh, it's, it's already powered up. And we will try to insert the coin. So if the coin is accepted, the coin will fall from here. But if the coin is rejected, the coin will fall from here. Okay, let's try. I have the 500 rupiah coin. We will try to insert the 1000 and okay, it's mean rejected. The coin is rejected. We will try again and it's rejected again. How about if we insert the right coin, the 500 rupiah coin? and mm, it's fall from behind from here it means that the coin is accepted and we try this one and it's rejected too it's rejected and this is used if the coin is stuck inside, we can use this. Okay, and now if we try to change the coin, so I will try to detect the 1000 rupiah. Try to insert the 500 and it's stuck, it's rejected. Try again, okay, it's stuck again, it's rejected. Try this yellow and it's rejected again, it's rejected again, and now if we insert the right coin the 1000 it's falling from behind it means that this coin is accepted okay now we have this coin acceptor work as we want and now we will try to read this sensor using Arduino let's try okay this is the sketch you can download from the link in the description below uh, this we are using the pin 2 input from the coin acceptor and then we use the interrupt so when every pin 2 had a rising state you can call the function name coin interrupt this is the function name coin interrupt and this is the function yeah, this is the function so we will add pulse by one and make the state of insert to true so whenever there is coin insert the insert value will true and in the loop we will make the if statement if insert is true then we make the insert false and then we will print the coin detected and we give the delay to one second okay let's upload the sketch and let's try if this sketch will work Okay, let's open the serial monitor. 
so whenever we insert the right coin not the false one in this case we use the 1000 rupiah coins so every we insert the 1000 rupiah coin it should serial print coin detect yes it's the coin is detect again we try again and the coin detect again and try again and that's the coin detect okay so how about if we insert the false coin and there is no coin detected in the serial monitor we try again and have the same result no coin detected no serial monitor print also this yellow one is not detected too okay this means that this sensor is working correctly as we want Now I will make a program that if every time we insert the 1000 coin it will add the balance by 1000 so if a 1000 coin insert the balance will be add by 1000 this is the program so we will add the balance by 1000 and we will print the output the balance to the serial monitor so we can use this to make anything we want like vending machine or whatever we need okay let's try in the serial monitor I will zoom the serial monitor and We'll insert the coin at the sensor. Okay. I will insert the 1000 rupiah coin and the balance is 1000. I will add it again and the balance is 2000 now and 3000 and then 4000 and then 5000 and then 6000. How about uh, if we insert the wrong coin and will no accept it so this is work good and we can use this to make like vending machine or whatever we want with this coin acceptor so I think that is our tutorial for today we will see you again in another tutorial. Bye!